Hello, this is Pete from Kutreset and today I'll show you how to create Windows 10 bootable USB stick. If you like this video, please thumbs up, subscribe and let me know in comments what you think. Okay, so to create bootable USB stick, you need to have two things. First of all, obviously USB stick, which needs to have at least 4 GB and media creation tool software. So I'm assuming you already have your USB stick. Let's download media creation tool. I'll put a link to the download page in the description of that video. And now we don't want to upgrade, we want to download the tool now. So right now you need to plug in your USB stick to your USB port and let's run media creation tool. Choose create installation media. Hit next. Choose language for your Windows. Uh, Windows Edition and Architecture. Hit Next. USB Flash. Next. Choose Write USB in case you have uh, others listed here. Hit Next. And let's wait while bootable USB is being created. Now, while Media Creation Tool is creating bootable USB stick for you, let me tell you about two main causes why this tool can crash. One is that your USB stick is not plugged in directly to USB port, only through SpeedHub, for instance. This might be a cause why this tool can fail creating bootable USB for you. So please make sure that your USB stick is connected directly to your laptop or to your PC, not through USB SpeedHub. And the second one is your firewall. And this is because during the creation process of USB stick, media creation software is testing whether USB is working by running auto run file that is created on your USB stick. And sometimes your antivirus software can block that which media creation software will take as a failure of the test. And then you will see a screen saying that the software has not been able to create USB bootable stick. So just keep in mind about those two things. Okay, there you go. Your bootable USB stick is ready to be used. Just remember that it will take a lot longer for you to create bootable USB stick than during this video since I used time lapse and uh, cut off uh, part of the scenes so you don't have to watch percent going from 0 to 100 for 20 minutes. Now last thing to uh, do is to tell your laptop or PC to use this USB stick to boot the system. And this very depends on your motherboard type. So for instance, for my motherboard type, I can during the boot up process, I can hit F2 to enter a boot options and other options or F11, which takes me directly to boot menu. From there, I can choose USB bootable stick, double click on on it and let the system start. For you it might be um, different ways, like I said it differs, um, depends on your motherboard type. You need to keep attention what is written on the screen when your system is booting up. Most likely it will tell you which key to hit to enter boot options. So that's it, thanks for watching, subscribe, give me thumbs up, let me know in comments what you think and best of luck. <laughs>